This video provides a general overview on how to install edge trims on a fiberglass roof. It's part three in a five part series that covers health and safety, decking and installation, edge trim installation, laminating and top coat application. This is for a warm flat roof design. Trims are positioned around the edges of the flat roof as well as the interface between the wall and the roof. They're designed to cover edges, provide protection to the perimeter, improve rainwater channeling, and add shape and aesthetics to the roof. You can purchase resin library fiberglass roofing kits in a range of sizes. Simply click the link in the description below. Otherwise, give us a like and subscribe. As you can see, edge trims should be neatly installed and positioned on the edges of the roof. If overlapping trims are required, ensure a 50 to 100 mm overlap. When trims are overlapped, the joint should be sealed using a continuous bead of adhesive. Measure the length of the perimeter required and pre-cut sections of the edge trims to size. The aim is to avoid adding any jagged edges or any bits of trim protruding from the roofing perimeter. Position the trims on the edges of the roofing structure and secure in place using 20 or 30 mm clout nails. Use one nail every six inches. Different sections of the roof perimeter will have different types of trims. This one for instance is a wall trim designed to go up against a brick wall or an equivalent substrate. Later on it will get covered in laminate, top coat and eventually lead flashing as you can see in this schematic here. Prior to installing the drip trim, insert a timber batten. This positions the trim away from the wall so that rainwater can be channeled into an adjacent gutter. When using the drip edge trims, it may be necessary to include two timber battens as shown here. To ensure the bottom edge of the trim is located as close to the centre of the gutter to be installed as possible. If so, the first batten should be fixed just below the level of the deck and the second 10mm below the first. Allow the trim to sit in line with the roof. This concludes the edge trim installation and the roof is now ready for the fiberglass laminate. This video is for general informational purposes only. It does not constitute construction related advice, whereas in library is not reliable for any outcomes. The use of information linked to this video is at the user's own risk. The content in this video is not intended to be a substitute for professional advice. Users should not disregard in obtaining professional advice.